Okay, so I start off with washing my hair and blow drying it using this got to be volume root lifting spray. It's amazing. I literally put it into my uh, roots, massaged it in, and um, then just blow dry my hair. Uh, using this powder brush, I take out any sort of knots while my hair's still wet, and then just blow dry it, just so my curls come out cleaner. Okay, so your hair's prepped. I then heat up my Diva uh, Professional Styling Tool. This is the tongs that I use, guys. They're amazing. I get them from Sally's. Uh, this is the 32 mil because the thicker they are, um, I feel like the curls don't stay in as long. So these ones are quite good. Um, yeah, like I said, you can pick them up from Sally's, from Amazon. Um, but you want to get them right to the 210. Get it as hot as possible. Leave it for about a good five minutes. They do heat up really quickly. So just be careful that you don't burn yourself. Um, and then all you want to do is you want to section your hair into two, like so. You can make sure your hair's dry, otherwise you're going to end up burning it. Um, I get one of these clips, and then I just section this section out. I'm just taking like a good handful. My hair's not that thick, so I just make it look thick with products. Maybe even less actually, about that much. And then you're just going to clip the rest of the section up. If you find this is getting annoying, you can clip this up as well. Well, I'm quite used to it. Um, so I'm going to use my tools. And whenever I do curls, I always do it facing away from my face. So don't ever do it going inwards like this. You always want to do it going outwards like that. Yeah, cool. One sec. Okay, so like I was saying, because I was really interrupted. Um, 32 mil uh, tongs that I use called Diva. And then I literally section these little bits out and I hold it like this and I I make sure that it's flat and I I'll tell you what I mean so when I'm doing it I'm making sure my hair is flat and away from my face and just keep it there and then I just let it go like that because we're gonna brush these out after so don't worry about them being too tight what I mean is some sometimes when you curl you just grab a section and curl it you don't want to do it like that you want to make sure the whole section is flat so that the iron is getting to every single strand and that's how curls last longer as well so I'm just going to repeat that for this whole section and then I'm going to go section by section so I do all of this side first and then I do all of the rest of the side if you find it hard to section then get some more um butterfly clips and just kind of hold your hair in place but I kind of just do it roughly because it's kind of like a messy, wavy look that I'm going for. I just burn it. There we go. So I've done this, and then what I'm going to do next is I just take another section that's a bit thick, maybe half this as well. That's it. And then I just clip this top bit away like that and I'm just gonna start curling this to keep these curls away I can push them back and then continue curling this push them back continue curling this so I'm just gonna curl this side and I'll be back once I'm at the top okay so getting there um I've managed to curl all this top section let me just have a look in the mirror I just need to curl this front bit here so same again just divide it into little parts and it is a bit of an arm workout but um, you'll get your curls really neat if they're all in the same direction. So I'm just going to flat once again, just let it out and get the front bit as well because the front bit is really important. You want to go do it backwards so that your hair looks big rather than doing it frontwards because that will make it look big. So once you've curled all this section here, I don't actually like putting hairspray in my hair because I feel like products just make it sticky for me. So I keep it like this, but I just run my hand just through it. So it's just kind of rough and wavy. And you set the front however you want. When you blow dry your hair, try setting it then. So this is the difference. Um, I'm just going to go back and do this section of my hair. Once again, let me just show you. I section it off. And then I do it in about two inch sections. Um, and I've lost my clip. Okay, I'm going to find my clip and then I'll come back. 
Okay, so I'll start on my clip. <laughs> Let's try again. Um, I'm just going to take two inch section, like so, and clip this all up and away. And then we're going to start curling. Going outwards again, opposite hands if you want. Um, I'm actually okay using the same hand, but it's totally up to you. Um, I'm just going to unclip this. If it gets too hot, just turn down the heat a bit, but I do it a bit hotter so that the curls last a few days. You can even do this the night before you go out and um, they'll last the next day if you spray them. So I'm just going to, once again, going backwards, just like that, this hair on my front. Okay, um, going to keep going, curling this whole section. It doesn't take that long once you get the swing of things. And you're doing it the same direction for every single strand on each side. Once again. <laughs> okay, um, getting there. So yeah, it doesn't take that long. I think I have about five sections on each side. Um, and I divide it in about five as well, including the top. So I'm going to just do that. It might be a bit too big. So I might just split that one in half like that, create two curls. It is a really awkward angle, but once you master it, you're fine. If you want to get somebody else to do it for you, um, that's fine as well. Just make sure that they go um, backwards whenever they do it and not front ways. I think that's the trick. Here we go. I go behind, but you can actually go from the front. As in, let me show you. There we go. I go like this, <laughs> but you can actually just go like this, but I feel like I can start from the top when I go from behind. Okay, so I'm going to do the same, and I'm just going to work my way up, and I'll come back when I'm on the top there. Okay, so we're back. Um, so I have now managed to curl all this section. It took me about seven minutes. Um, and can you see how this is curlier than this side? Because I've brushed this side out, so that's what you want to get to. So I'm just going to take this last section off now. Um, this last section you can split into two as well, just because I flattened this quite a bit. There we go. I can't just see in this camera, so bear with me. There we go. It's a section here. So I'm just going to take sections like I said. If your hair is really thin, I'd say take smaller sections, only because um, it will make your hair look thicker. And then you can just back comb each section as well, just so it gives you that kind of volume that you're after. Okay, so I'm just going to do the same. Getting there. Okay. And then this last section here. I'm just going to split this into a few. And just curl these it's actually so simple like when I do this every single day now it comes so simply it takes me about 10 minutes to do so once you get the hang of things it won't take you that long I'm just gonna make sure I've done everything in the mirror one sec. okay here we go so I'm gonna do the exact same thing with this side um, and just brush it out to make it slightly bigger and that volumizing spray that I used earlier this one is basically giving me that volume in my roots that I need and if you want to you can just spray it now but yeah that's it really and that's how I get those volumized curls you can tuck it behind your ear and move it you can pin it you can move it all to the side and um, you can have a side parting and have it curly so you could do loads with it. I can even tie it up if I really wanted to and just pin it randomly. Um, even when I have a pony, I like to just curl it and then have a curly pony. So you can do loads with it. It's really, really good tongs, guys. Um, I think they're about £30. Uh, have a look. I'll have a look as well and I'll post a link for them. But yeah, it's a 32mm, guys, from Sally's. Amazing.